In this problem, it is given that A and B are mutually exclusive events and the values for P, A and P, B are given. We have to find these probabilities. Since A and B are mutually exclusive, we can say that A and B are mutually exclusive. Now, what does this imply? This implies A intersection B is empty. That means, from this we can say that P of A intersection B is therefore 0. And also it is given that P of A is equal to 0 0.35 and P of B is equal to 0 0.45. So, let us find one by one. First part is P of A complement we have to find. So, what is P A complement? Now, P A complement is given by 1 minus P A and we know that P of A is 0 0.35. So, it is 1 minus 0 0.35 and this gives us 0 0.65. So, this is the answer for the first part. Then second P B complement we need. So, P B complement is equal to 1 minus P of B which is equal to 1 minus 0 0.45 and this gives us 0 0.55. Then part C P A union B, P probability of A union B. Now, P A union B is by formula P A plus P B minus P A intersection B. You see, we need not write this as well because it is given mutually exclusive. If A and B are mutually exclusive, just we can say P A union B is P A plus P B or it is ok if we write then just put this as 0. So, this will be equal to P A is 0 0.35, then P B is 0 0.45 and minus this is of course, 0. So, this gives 0.35 plus 0.45 which is 0 0.80. Then the D part, D part is P A intersection B. Of course, that we have already written because it is mutually exclusive. This is equal to 0. So, this is done. Then E part, this is important P A intersection B complement. So, this is equal to what is the formula for A intersection B complement? it is P A minus P A intersection B. P A intersection B complement is P A minus P A intersection B, which is P A is 0 0.35 minus of course, A intersection B 0. So, it is again equal to 0 0.35. Then the last bit that is part F is P A complement intersection B complement intersection B complement, but A complement intersection B complement by sets we know that it is A union B complement. So, this can be written as P of A union B complement, but again this is nothing but 1 minus P of A union B if we remove the complement. Therefore, this is equal to 1 minus and what is P A union B we have found that is 0 0.80, 0 0.80 and this gives us 0 0.20 or 0 0.2. So, therefore, we have the first answer is 0 0.65, then 0 0.55, then 0 0.80, then P A intersection B is 0 because A and B are mutually exclusive. And P A intersection B complement, this is the formula we have and it is 0 0.35. And P A complement intersection B complement, this is important because A complement intersection B complement is A union B complement. And again P of A union B complement is 1 minus P of A union B, it is 1 minus 0.8 which is 0 0.20. So, these are the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 answers that we have found.